Our very own Steve asks, which marketing vehicles are working best to grow the businesses of the startups you've invested in? Steve, a, a, a hardcore uh, VaynerMedia employee working on data and insights. Um, wonder if this is a hedged question or not, but Steve, the answer to this question is clearly Facebook dark posts. I've pounded this over and over. I don't think, it's funny, the real, the VaynerMedia clients don't recognize what's going on. All my investment companies are only playing in this space. You, you know, I'm gonna look it up right now in real time. I'm gonna predict right here on the spot that Wish, the app Wish, the shopping app, is probably in the top 150 in the app store. This is a company, met the founder at Cannes last year, the big advertising festival. Let's just go through this, Facebook, Facebook, by the way. Um, Dub Mash, I missed it. Oh God, I, met, I Skyped with the founder of Dub Mash from Berlin like seven weeks ago, I was so on it. 10, 15 weeks ago, I screwed it up. Snapchat, okay. Uh, this is what I do all the time, by the way. d you can focus here. Every, every so often, actually I didn't do it this morning, which is fun to do it. I'm just always looking at the top 100 apps to basically get a feel. And usually, actually, where I'm most excited about is down here, right? Because, you know, the top is pretty consistent. But has anything popped up here, like, you know, Wallapop, you know, like those kind of things, I'm always kind of trying to see. Let me just see if Wish is here. I'm going to get somewhere out there. It is. 112, zoom in, baby. Yep. 112. All Facebook dark posts. And I mean all Facebook dark posts. If people understood what was going on arbitrage wise on Facebook dark posts right now, which is the slang term, Facebook advertising platform where you can reach anybody that you want, if people understood that, they would win every single time, just like Google AdWords in the early 2000s that Amazon and eBay used to build their businesses. Still can't believe people don't understand this is what happened. Uh, Facebook is absolutely the place that, um, that you can't milk enough of that cow right now. And again, over the next 24 to 48 months, it will disappear and it will more, more or less level out and become appropriate. Right now it's underpriced. In four years, I'll still love it, intuitively I believe, but it's gonna be appropriate. I'll be like, this is worth it, just exactly worth it, not this is worth eight bucks and I'm paying a dollar for it. So Facebook dark posts, if, if, if my startups could spend every penny they had, they would on that place. Pinterest starting to emerge a little bit as well.